can you solve this math challenge? Here's the question. Given this clock that shows 330, then the question is what is the acute angle between the hands of the clock? You can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. And now, let's answer this question together. So, the target in this question is to get the acute angle between the hands, the clock, or simply this angle, theta. Now, there's a formula to answer this kind of question, and here's the formula to be used. So, the angle between the hands of the clock must be equal to the absolute value of 30 times h minus 11 times m all over 2. Now, what are those variables here? Now, this theta right here must be the angle between the hour hand and the minute hand. Now, how about this h right here? This is the number of hours. And this m right here is the number of, of course, the number of minutes. So, in our given, the angle between the hour hand and the minute hand is unknown, so this is question mark. Now, h is the number of hours, so our time is 3.30. Therefore, the value of h must be equal to 3. And since we have 3.30, the number of minutes must be 30, or m must be equal to 30. And what we're going to do here is to substitute all those given values to our formula and find out the angle or the acute angle between the hands of this clock. All right, so let's substitute. So we have h must be equal to 3 and m must be equal to 30. Now let's simplify this. 30 times 3 will give us 90. And 30 is just 2 times 15, so we can cancel out 2 factor of 2 on the numerator and denominator. So this is just 11 times 15. Now, 11 times 15 is very easy. This is just 165. And then we need to subtract 90 to 100, negative 165, and this will give us negative 75. And take note that we need to get the absolute value of negative 75. And the absolute value of negative 75 must be 75. Therefore, the angle between the hands of the clock that shows 330 must be 75 degrees. And as always, we are done.